know what I'm saying? Because he started running off at the mouth. Soon the man get locked up, he started, yeah, 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 yeah. We ain't heard from this yeah, time like me, way. me personally though, bro. I don't think he got anything to do with him getting locked back up. But it is a moment for um uh, finesse two times. Like a lot of people were saying, like far as the snippet of his diss song, you know what I'm saying? He put out a little snippet. People were seeing it, they like, yo, you need to come harder than that. But now I'm thinking like finesse probably gonna drop that diss song tomorrow, which is Friday. You know what I'm yeah, saying? He Most came back out. On Friday. You see how he come back out talking loud? Oh, he did. It's like you know, he got that pressure up off him now. Now he going hard in the blog. Like he wasn't talking this much in two, three weeks. You know what I'm saying? Now he going back hard. You know what I'm talking about? So it is what it is. We're gonna see what's going on, man. We're gonna see how everything really shit. Who the unfold. real king? Of, like, let's keep it a buck though. Who the real king of Memphis right now, bro? Oh, right now, who the real king of Memphis stand, G? You know what I'm talking about? I'm putting up these numbers on these for everybody watching me. If I got everybody watching me, get another year, bro. But far as like let, on the rapper the side, on the rapper it's side, off. on the rapper Dolph. side. You know what I'm saying? Dolph? I'm gonna keep it on. I'm keep it on that level. Dolph is undisputed, bro. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody else. Tell me about that. your relationship with Young Dolph, bro. How did that come I met Dolph, Dolph three times. You know what I'm talking about? I met Dolph at the war show. You know what I'm talking about? I met Dolph at a show, and I met Dolph at Street Exec Studios in Atlanta. You know what I'm talking about? Every time we met up, my he shook hand, locked eyes. I'm talking about real down to earth, genuine dog, man. You know what I'm talking about? And it is what it is. Ain't nobody would like bro in the city. My shoulder city, much love shoulder city. I ain't doing nothing but around with dog. You know what I'm talking about? It is what it is, man. Oh man, when you had a chance to talk to his um his his wife as well, right? And you told her the same thing that you was gonna be riding riding for Dolph, and you know you gave yeah, her your word that you was gonna stand you know on that. Shout out to Mia. You know what I'm talking about? And she already know what it is with me, man. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do this thing together. We pushing with the city, you know what I'm talking about? We trying to make the city be great again. And it is what it is, man. And we ain't stopping it out. And you know what I'm saying? She gonna push it to a whole nother level, man. Watch what she do, man. She doing great things. Shout out to me. No, oh, for sure, for sure, for sure, bro. That's crazy. You got any relationship with any adult artists though? The ones that you know what I'm saying that's still moving right now? Like when it comes to Key oh. Glock, um, um, uh, group, what is it, Grove on uh, Hero? Grove Hero, uh, me and Grove Hero, we locked in, we super cool, you know what I'm saying? Everybody over there at PIE, I, I talked to all them boys, you know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna see me with them boys in a quick second, staying G, man, with BEO and BEO locked in with them boys, shot the NLE chopper. That's the young dude in the city, you know what I'm talking about, who really crowning on a whole nother level right now. I'm just gonna keep it real. BEO got the streets, and NLE got the other side, got the industry on lock. Oh, man, shout out to them boys. Yeah, did you ever had a chance to meet Ella Lee Chopper? No, nah, I ain't me and Lee ain't ran into each other yet, but we're gonna we're gonna get our time though. I know he know about me, I know he see me, you know what I'm talking about, because I'm with the people he with, you know what I'm saying? So I know we're gonna cross paths sooner or later, you know what I'm saying? Like NLE Chopper, like so when it comes to like you said he got the other side, like does the streets respect him? Yeah, he respected in the streets, you know what I'm saying? He respected in the streets, he got it. He he got some people, you know what I'm talking about, that's really about it, but at the same time, you know, like 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 cats like that, I want to keep them out of the streets. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm mm -hmm. for. You know what I'm talking about? I don't want to push them boys to, to go to the street level. He got already got the industry on his side. He got a whole nother type of fan base he's dealing with at a young age, but he gonna take it to that next level. He's gonna push people like us to the next level because he he watching us right now. You understand, G. So he's gonna see us putting this grind in, he's gonna keep on putting this grind in. And we're gonna grow together. That's how that's how I'm making this thing happen in the city right now. So yeah. you think you got Memphis on your back right now, bro? Oh yeah, I got Memphis on my back right now. My everybody see what I'm doing, you know what I'm saying? Some people is misunderstood, they really don't see me, like they don't, they don't know what I'm doing, they don't know if I'm really but I'm really for the positive, but I know it's a balance with everything, you know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about? So sometimes you gotta get negative to go back positive in the guy, I and mean, it's just what it is. We ain't stopping it all, my man until the day I die. Man. I got it on my back for real, Jack. Understand, G, for real. So, like, you, you were speaking earlier about Big A. Like, um, what was your relationship with Big A? Uh, Big A, my dog, I talked to him yesterday. You know like what I'm saying? Like, you, like, you meet him when you was younger? Like, how did you meet him? No, nah, no, nah, me and Big A, we've we, we been locked in for probably, like, about a good, I'd say about a good four, five years. You know what I'm talking about? But his big dog, you know what I'm saying? Like, his his big dog, we, uh, we, we were... Locked in, locked in, you know what I'm talking about? RP the court dog, man. They know what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. RP the court. And then you got B B E O, right? And um, 
he basically then he come out with a diss song on finesse two times when he first like when he first dropped after he got up and from jail. B.O. They had B what got it them back in the days, you know what I'm saying? Way right. back, you know what I'm talking about, like 10, 10 years ago when got it when Gucci went and got signed out on boys in Memphis, that would be yo them, you know what I'm talking about? The, the first people, the first way that Gucci came and got the first Memphis cast he came and got was B yo them. So it's, it, and it's still going. See, when little B yo was the he was one of the youngest who ended up just getting out of jail and now he flourished again, you know what I'm talking about? And now you seeing him and Gucci back. Locked in, you know what I'm talking about. Everything coming full circle. And then you you got this whole situation like with Bo, like you know finesse, right? So they got they back and forth. You got the situation with Big A. Big A, do he have a problem with um finesse, or is that not that not being said? Like my, that, that. that was his brother, so I don't know what's gonna happen later on. But to my knowledge, he don't mess with him, and it is what it is. You know what I'm talking about. He don't mess with him at all right now. You know what I'm talking about. Like you cross your brothers, bro. Sometimes you probably can't never get back in the car, and it's real. Mm. Yeah, that's deep. That's deep. That's deep, right there, my brother. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, man, y'all get this live up, man. We got about 160 people in the building, man. Um, right up, go right ahead, up, right uh, up. like, share, share this on Facebook and Twitter. Let them know what we got going on. You know what I'm saying? Hashtag finesse two times. Hashtag um honeycomb brazy. So like. How did you meet Honeycomb Brazy, bro? Like, how did that really come about? We, we was on we was on the same energy pad, bro. When Honeycomb just got out just now, and I know he been seeing all my my blogs and blogs and everything from back in the day, but this time we jumped out, we was on the same energy pad, and we just one night he just hit me up my hollering, and the next day I was hollering at him. You know what I'm talking about? We on live. You know what I'm talking about? He was like, bro, that's enough money for all of us out here, and I salute him for that sense. You know what I'm talking about? He was a real nigga on his word and, and really put me in a position to win. And then BEO did it right after that. Man, I ain't number love for them boys for the rest of my life. You know what I'm saying? I can't do nothing but man, be loyal to them boys. Oh, man. No, for yeah, sure. And then the people in the comments, you know what I'm saying? We got the comments. They like Lil Kenny and uh, BEO standing on business. Like, what's your thoughts on Lil Kenny, gang? Man, Lil Kenny, he one of those guys, man. You know what I'm saying? I want y'all to see his movie when the movie come out, man. He one of those yeah. guys. You know what I'm saying? Five, five, but one of those guys, man. You know what I'm talking about? And it is what it is. Y'all gonna hear about B.E.O. Lil Kenny no matter what. I know it's gonna be a documentary coming out about, you know what I'm saying, about, about their whole group. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Spooky Duke, too, man. Spooky Duke was jail with Future when he jumped out. You know what I'm saying? Future came and got him up. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's gonna be a major movie behind this whole situation, man. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Yeah. No, for sure, for sure. So Stupid Duke and Lil Kenny, they gonna have a whole like movement. It's a whole movement behind that, like as far as movie and shit. Yeah, young multi me and uh YML, you know what I'm saying? Young yeah, the mob, man. Them, them boys doing their thing, salute to them boys. Yeah, no, no doubt, bro. And then this whole situation when it comes to just like is it like for, for finesse to say fuck Mobile, Alabama, bro? I'm gonna keep it real with you, bro. Is is Memphis standing behind that? Is they saying fuck Mobile, Alabama? Can you speak? Man, on that? No, the South is not standing behind their mind at all. He really didn't miss it up through the whole South because it's Mobile folks all through the South, especially in Atlanta. You know what I'm saying? So now nah, we ain't riding behind it. No Memphis folks ain't really finna ride behind it. You know what I'm talking about? Really, I'm trying to see. Do we think he got that big? To say something like that, he he big, bro. He very big. Only rap I seen get away with something like that was well, what's the mind name? Uh, I blow the uh blow New Jersey up. You know what oh, I'm saying? Chief Keith. Yeah, if he think he Chief Keith level, then come on, let be real. He ain't Chief Keith level, bro. You know what I'm saying? And it is with a hip. Oh yeah, rapper. Chief Keith. At that time, like let's rewind for a second. So Chief Keith, after he said, well, after he said this, but before. Kanye West, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I'm trying to think, like, did Finesse two times have, like, a feature like that or something? Because most of yeah. uh, Finesse features, it be, like, people that he trying to pull up. You know what I'm saying? Which I get. That's, that's, Kevin Gates. that's the only person who reached out there. But Kevin Gates ain't on the level of the Kanye West, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just, it is yeah, what it sure. is. So he ain't got that type of power. That they cry. He ain't even got the white folks. You know what I'm saying? Let's just keep it real. You know what I'm talking about? He ain't got the other demographic, you know what I'm saying? Let's keep it real, and it is what it is. So I don't know what he think he doing. He ain't got nothing but the streets, and he going against the streets right now. 
it don't make sense. It don't add up. You know what I'm saying? He's just crashing out saying anything. That's why you know he gonna wreck. He gonna he gonna he gonna wreck. If he drive, he gonna wreck the whole car, man. We see what's going on. He didn't wreck the car so many times. This the third time. He said he going back to the opening. You know the opening was going getting locked up. So he, yeah, he that's he, he, that, look, first. look. He did say that, and that's what was strange to me because he was saying like honeycomb braids. He was crashing out. He was one of the main ones. Like, yo, niggas crashing and I don't got and time for day, that shit. He flipped that quick. The next day he flipped. Now he finna crash out. Like, what yeah, you trying to prove? Up. Like, what you trying to prove? He got you that mad that you saying forget you gonna go out like him now, bro? I don't understand doing. He don't. He don't understand himself at this point. Cause he up and down. Just yesterday he saying he ain't, he ain't gonna crash. And then today somebody he's old for this. Come on, bro. We ain't believe yeah. in that, bro. So like the old, like you know, cause you knew finesse before we knew him. Like you the one put me up on finesse. And thank you. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, I got into that song. You know what I'm saying? Like actually, this was before the song even came out. You put yeah. me in tune with him when he was about to be released. And then I see his rollout. I'm like, damn, this nigga going crazy. And I love that first day out song, bro. Oh, so, yeah. so like, like I credit you for that. You know what I'm saying for sure. So you thinking like, it's it's like finesse is really about to crack. Like his old old finesse. Like what was old finesse doing differently from what he doing today? Uh, crashing out and uh, when he went in crashing out, just doing pulling dummy moves and end up in a dummy place. That's what he was doing before he. You know what I'm saying? He was a good rapper from the whole time. I'm keeping it all the way real. But he was pulling dummy moves, you know what I'm saying? Finessing his way back into a jail situation. That's the only thing he was doing. You know what I'm talking about? Going hard on going hard on money bad yo. When money bad yo gave you and put you in the game. Going hard on his first the first person who put him in the game and and and, and, and end up going behind the mind back, messing with the mind girl and stuff like that. Like he he been a crash out artist all his life, you know what I'm talking about? Dang. And like he said, he don't know nothing but jail. So I guess he definitely want to go back because he want to be the old this again. It is what it is. We don't feel sorry for him. He wants somebody to jump out there and say, "Man, no, nah, don't do that, bro." You you want somebody to really play? Hey, look, like I'm a, I'm gonna do it for you. I'm gonna do it for the people. I'm gonna if, if, finesse. If you looking for that, bro, look, don't do it, bro. Do not do it, bro. Your music is bomb. You're jamming, nigga. Like keep doing what you're doing, bro. Don't let motherfuckers cross you up into the bullshit, gang. That shit don't make no sense, man. You make you went from making zeros to motherfucking being the hero, bro. Like be the hero of the game, bro. Like we'll yeah. like the thing that we know about like personal issues and shit. That's because of what's going on now. I didn't never know that finesse is a possibility. Allegedly, he can't go back to Memphis. You know what I'm saying? Which like go do a show in Memphis, prove them folks wrong. Do the arena because you can do it now. See, now you sending him out there now. Don't do a show in Memphis and end up getting messed off, man. You know what I'm talking about now. Don't do that. And then and another thing, bro, he got he just got to get smart about 